The women and children of Garasa Boye know better than almost anyone the value of water. During the dry season in northern Ethiopia, they used to walk 11 miles to the nearest source to fill their water jugs. They drove them to donkeys or to their own backs and lug them home. When it's full, a five gallon jug weighs about 40 pounds. The villagers would carry them for hours. It was grueling work, especially for the old, the very young, and pregnant women. Samuel Abraha recalls the time one of her friends went into labor on the trek for water. The baby was born en route, but the women had nothing with which to cut the umbilical cord. So they made a sling from their shawls and carried the mother and child home, still connected to each other. The mother survived, but the baby died about a week later. Now, a source of water nearby means no child of Gerarsa Boye will enter the world like that again. A new dam and the small lake behind it are providing families with a year-round supply, just a short walk from their homes. The lake has changed their lives. The dam was built through a partnership between the local government, the Women's Association of Tigray, and Oxfam America. Drought had plagued the region for three years, and the dam was part of an emergency response launched during a time of severe water and food shortages. To help people earn money for food, Oxfam paid them to build terraces and dig trenches on the hillsides around the dam. That cash for work program protected the dam's 450 acre catchment area and prevented soil from running down and clogging the lake. The water was originally intended for livestock, but people began using it for other purposes too, like washing and drinking. So villagers developed a set of community rules for how to keep the water safe. And Oxfam is working with the Women's Association on a plan to build drinking troughs for the animals and a treatment system to ensure the supply is clean for families. Having water close to home means people now have time for other important activities, like cooking and school. The animals are benefiting too. They're producing more milk, which means more food and income for local families. For farmer and herder, Haddis Gede, the dam is everything. It provided the most important thing, he said, water. 